two of these. I have, I have plenty more of these to open up for you guys, but today is just going to be a quicker ASMR video. We're going to be opening up two of these and two little booster packs. I have a bunch more Chilling Rain. I'm going to do longer videos, opening up a lot more together all in one video. But today I wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update. Um, I'll show you guys a little update on what I've pulled off stream, off camera. Um, I have some pretty crazy pulls, so uh, let's get into that. I have this stack of cards right here. This is the stack that uh, between the last two days, me and my girlfriend, we've just been opening packs. We've been hanging out, uh, and honestly, like little did we know that we were just going to pull some crazy stuff so i felt like i would update you guys um obviously you guys saw me pull the charizard v max of the shining fates tins i didn't open up any more shining fates i want to do that on camera for you guys um but this is what i've pulled off camera and i thought it was pretty cool like this is really cool i haven't pulled some of these cards ever and i've opened up like 70 between like 70 to 80 it's probably higher than that now packs so let's start it off with the galarian articuno these i've started to pull a lot of these uh let's see i don't even know what order i have these in so it'll be a surprise to me too guys oh yes the ice rider calyrex v um one of my viewers mike Sol. He was telling me how he pulled the Shadow Rider. I'm not going to lie. When I first pulled this, I was facing it the other way. So my girlfriend could see it first. And then I turned it around towards me. And I thought for this split second that I pulled the Shadow Rider. But I am very happy to have pulled this card. This is an awesome card. Let's see what's behind this. Oh, yes. Holographic Thunderous. This is my first one, I think... I have the full art version of this card, but the, this is just the regular hollow. You can see the hollow. There you go. This is cool. I haven't really seen any of these. This is my first one, like just regular hollow. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The uh, Galarian Rapidash. So my girlfriend actually pulled this card. This card is gorgeous. I, I have so many duplicates of other full arts, and this is my first Galarian Rapidash. Like, just look at the colors on this. Look how this, like, sparkles in the back right here. This, like, flaming lines and the, the flowing mane. This is one of the better full art artworks. And the Galarian Slow King V. This is also my only one. Look how that shines, guys. This is really nice. Somebody was telling me how they pulled the uh, alternate art version of this. I... I haven't even sniffed an alternate art of any type. I can't believe that I haven't even opened a single one, but hopefully we can turn that luck around. This really cool card. What's the... Oh, yeah, yeah. The Galarian Moltres V. So this is my first and only one. I have, like, five Articunos. I have, like, five Zapdoses. This is my only Galarian Moltres. He has to be more rare. Like, somebody let me know if Moltres is more rare than the other two birds, because this is my only one. I was so ecstatic when we pulled this. This is an awesome card. Look at that. Dire Flame Wings. Once during your turn, you may attach a Fire Energy card from your discard pile to this Pokemon. You can't use it more than one Dire Flame Wings ability each turn. And Aurora Burn. Aura Burn. This, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. What's behind it? Oh, yep. Yeah. Another Galarian Articuno. Another Zapdos V. Oh, yeah. So, I got a little peek as to what is behind this. I was stunned when we pulled these cards that are behind this. Ready, guys? Look at that. A Golden Trainer Fog Crystal. So, I didn't pull either of these. My girlfriend pulled both. We were just sitting on the bed, sitting down, hanging out. Uh, we were just opening up packs and chilling. And uh, 
she managed to pull two of them. She pulled two. What? I didn't even pull these. The We got the, the Golden Trainer Echoing Horn and the Golden Trainer Fog Crystal. How crazy is that? These are awesome. Like these, these are like what makes opening cards good. I was like in shock. We opened these up like not even that long apart from each other. Like what are the chances? What are the chances on that? But yeah, get a good look at these. Like these are epic. And we have the Full Art Trainer Paeonia. This is a really cool one. But come on now. Look at these. These are so cool. I'm just like ecstatic to have these. These are such a good collectible. Bulbasaur back a little. Like, that is so cool. That is just so cool. I'm so excited that we pulled those. Alright, guys. Let's crack into these Snorlax tin, uh, packs. I almost called them tins. Frozen Tundra. Look at that Shadow Rider. So yeah, one of my one of my viewers pulled this. I'm shocked. Like I haven't even seen that. I'm jealous of that. Look at that Shadow Rider. Calyrex V Max. Let's see what we could do. Wow, first. 
first card, first pack we opened already was a hit. I will always be excited when we pull one of the birds. Plate, Flaffy, Path to Beak, Golette, Porygon, 
are so cool. If you look closely, you can see hidden Kecleons. There's a blue one, a red one, there's one's tail right here, there's a camouflaged one back there with a red line, purple one, there's like a ton, there's one down here. Next time you see this Kecleon card, or just pause the video and look around, there's way more than you think. There's one right here, it's kind of nuts actually. One of the better artworks I've ever seen on any card. Let's go. Let's go. And a Galarian Weezing. Wow, we do not have this card yet. I'm excited to have that out of a green pack, especially. Usually we don't expect to get anything out of that. And we're also going to open up these two. Let's see what we can do. Let's give you a, a little tapping.
Reverse Hollow Steena. And a Serena. Look at that. Look at that. What are the chances? That's funny. Funny way to end. So I could talk to you guys for a little bit before I have to go, but uh not not too crazy of any like wild hits in this on today's video. This was good pull. This reverse holo Chrysalia. Um Let's see, we had the Articuno hit, yep, the Articuno, yeah, um, yeah, that was pretty crazy over the past two days, off camera, opening up these two Echoing Horn Fog Crystal Golden Trainers, that was wild, um, so, I'm gonna be opening up a ton more Chilling Rain packs, those three packs with Snorlax and Eevee promo cards, um, <clears throat> I'll do plenty of videos opening up way more than just two packs each. I'll probably do like 10 ASMR videos opening up like 10. Oh, I'll be churning out that content. I just wanted to make a, a quick post today before I had to uh, get my day going, start the day, do some work. Um, maybe uh, maybe later on today I'll try to check some my local stores, my card sections, see if I can pick up any uh, anything different. Maybe just some more Pokemon cards. Uh, I'll check that out for you guys. Um, yeah, so I'll also be posting another video. I still have to open up two. I have two of these left. I, I'll probably have more by the end of the day. I doubt that BJ sold out of all these. I'll, I'll try to get more of these. These, these were extremely fun to open. Um, and I want to start trying to get into like the football community because... Uh, NFL football is going to start kicking back up soon, so I'm just going to start posting football content, Pokemon content. Um, also, tonight is Monday, July 5th at the time of this recording. Uh, it's not tonight, but tonight, like later on tonight, um, is game four of the Stanley Cup Finals. Um, as we predict, or as I predicted, I don't know what you guys were thinking, but uh, the, the Tampa Bay Lightning are up three games to none on the Montreal Canadiens. In my earlier videos, I predicted that the the Tampa Bay Lightning would just steamroll Montreal, and that does seem to be the case. Um, pretty underwhelming Stanley Cup final. Uh, I didn't really have any dog in the fight. I I didn't really care who won. Uh, obviously, I picked the Lightning, so uh, that's pretty cool to see Tampa Bay win it back-to-back. -back. Doesn't happen very often when a team goes back-to-back. -back. They are a really talented group of players, and uh, they deserve it. Montreal had a good run there, but I don't see Montreal coming back from a 3-0 deficit. Um, I will be opening up some more hockey cards. I'll probably do that sooner rather than later because hockey season is going to be coming to an end and people are just going to stop caring for the most part. So I'll try to just pull through these, not in today's video, in a separate video. Um, but yeah, Tampa Bay Lightning will most likely be your uh, Stanley Cup champions. And the NBA Finals are going to be starting. I do not have any basketball cards. Um, I never really was into opening basketball cards. I do like basketball. Basketball is awesome. But uh, honestly, basketball cards are just so hard to come by. And basketball cards are just so hard to hit with. Uh, I'm not the biggest basketball fan. I'm not going to be opening basketball cards on my channel. Maybe I'll purchase a pack or two if I see some at the stores. But most likely, I will not be touching NBA cards on this channel. So uh, that's like a sports update. Um, I will be watching the NBA Finals, though. That should be starting up the Milwaukee Bucks versus the Phoenix Suns. That'll be kicking off. Um, I don't have a dog in that fight either. I'm not a fan of either team. Um, honestly... Like, Giannis Antetokounmpo, if Giannis gets a ring, he probably might not even play for the most part of this series, but he is injured. If Giannis is able to get a ring, I'll be happy for him because he is a freaking stud, that guy. And if if the Suns win it, then I don't even care. Like, 
Chris Paul gets a ring, Devin Booker gets a ring at a young age, uh, would be really cool. So let me know what you guys think. Any suggestions? Any comments of like, uh, have you guys pulled any gold cards? I have a few viewers that comment pretty much on all my videos. I want to know if you guys have pulled any golden cards. Um, I'm still looking for that golden Snorlax. Um, I'm not going to complain about the getting the golden trainers, though. And I'm pretty sure that these golden cards are one in a hundred. I think they're one in every 100 packs. And I pulled these, like, very close to each other. Way less than 100 packs between, like, honestly, probably, like, within, like, 10 packs of each other. So, crazy odds right there. Very lucky. Um, and, yeah, that'll do it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for subscribing to the channel. We are slowly growing. Don't forget to hit that like button. Uh, subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. We are slowly growing as a channel. Um, I think I hit a 14 subscribers already. I'm ex so ecstatic about that. Um, it lets me know that you guys are liking the content, like watching what I'm pulling. Even you guys are just hanging out with me. I'm able to just talk with you guys. Um, yeah, so thank you so much for joining me up in the treehouse today. I will be making more content. Have a good day, guys. Um, take it easy, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.